Modern Challenge winners. The girls have done it again. Sharon and Helen, congratulations. You don't mind putting the drama in, though, do you? Oh, I tell you, mate, bloody hell. Got that one by the skin of our oh. teeth, eh? But, oh, look, we've had a fantastic four days. And for that to happen, like, what was we 150 metres from the finish line? I was like, she's screaming at me. We're not going to finish the rally. I said, I will push the bloody car <laughs> over. We've got a minute and 40 seconds. I'm going to push it. But thank God we had enough speed, a bit of downhill, and bring us over the finish line. And uh, do you know what? I think we deserved it. We did. <laughs> we bloody worked hard for four days. So, yeah, thank God. And now that's part of it. This will be a satisfying victory because, you, like you said, you did a great job and you earned it all the way. Oh, yeah, this one's been tough right from day one. We've had dramas, you know, with the car the whole time, but you see my crew in the background? Yeah. Can't speak highly enough of them, Dean. Um, MTA, they've done everything they can, and thank you to my precious girl over there for all her work on the car. Yeah, um, yeah this one's really satisfying. Yeah. Well, you two are fabulous characters. You have a great team. We love having you here. We reckon, you know, enjoy the spoils. I think you've done a fabulous yeah. job. So how do I get over the finish line now? That's the question. No, yeah. <laughs> Steering wheel, skates. <laughs> I think just go over in the suits and pretend just make the noises. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Classic challenge winners, and what a great job in the Porsche. Paul Thompson, Vanessa Saunderson, congratulations. I, I think you're a bit surprised that you've come through and won. Yeah, shocked. <laughs> really shocked. I would have right. thought with your talent and previous experience, you would have been a shoe in. Seven years, I've been trying, Paul. No, just pure luck. <laughs> pure luck. Well, maybe you do have a lucky charm, Vanessa. You said seven for you here, your very first run at a Tiger event, and you're on the victory dais. I hope so. <laughs> and you said you think luck of the Irish, though. Oh, definitely the luck of the Irish. <laughs> lucky charm. How did you find the whole four days? It's been fabulous weather. What do you think of it all? Fantastic. Last word. Really enjoyed it. Yeah. No. Awesome rally. Yeah. Well, congratulations to you two. Classic job, and we can't wait to see you next year then. Well done. Shamrock. <laughs> Paul Moll, Tony Lisa White, congratulations, classic winners for this year, what an awesome job mate, well done. Mate, what a weekend, it's, it wasn't easy, I mean, start off with us just uh, second for second, and then, um, you know, a bit of uh, bad luck for the um, Piranha, but they didn't give up, yeah. they kept battling, we had to push hard all weekend, and um, yeah, it's just been a tough weekend, we were exhausted after yesterday mate, <laughs> we were just shot. Lisa, unsung hero I reckon, is that right? I, I look, there's only one person who made a mistake all weekend. And that was me. Yeah. The service crew, the mechanic, Lisa, made him put a foot wrong. Lisa, co-drivers aren't just calling the notes. When stuff's happening, you know, I remember chatting to this guy last night. He had a big day trying to manage a lead his heart. And sometimes it's the co-driver's job to be the PA in the car. And I think you've done a fabulous one. Well done. Yeah, absolutely. I had to pull him up in the last couple of stages there. We were just pushing way too hard for the end of the day. And the tyres weren't up to it. The brakes weren't up to it. Um, I guess mentally we weren't up to it and we had to back off and actually we, we finished up the last two stages much better than the two before it so I think we handed away at least 30 seconds in the, in the prior two stages, it was just silly so um, yeah absolutely you have to uh, control yourself mentally, try not to push too hard and yeah and even just now in this last stage we just had to say no, we, we, we can lose it before we can win it here yeah. so absolutely. Well, yeah. Paul, a lot of work, I mean great scenes here with the kids anyway because this is your first one, you've battled, you've been always at the point in. Um, tell me what the feeling is like right now. Oh, it's, it's just elation, I mean we came out in 2012, it was our first serious effort. We came in second behind Tolly Chalice and, and that's a driver with a lot of experience, a lot of class. Um, and the next two years just DNF'd. You know, it's weren't good enough, we come off or we, you know, just whatever. This year it's all come together, we got new suspensions set up. I've got to say thanks to um, Oscar from Super Shock helping us do the set up. 
fantastic car, really handled really well. We had a bit of an issue in Calamunda. Um, the suspension was a bit too soft, and once we sorted that out, the car's been great ever since. Competition Modern winners, congratulations again, Peter Major, Greg Flood, well done guys, awesome job by both of you. Cheers. Yeah, cheers, thank, thank you very you. much. Tell me, what was this year like? It was almost like a rally of two halves for you. I know, just up and down like normal, you know, we uh, had the issues in the first couple of days and then yesterday we fixed it on Friday night and then yesterday sort of we came out with a mindset we had to drive really hard to get that lead back and then, you know, through the unfortunate events of Wilco, you know, blowing up and Rulo having issues, we then sort of gained a pretty big lead that we just had to manage. So, yeah, no, we're lucky and then we didn't tell anyone but the head's been playing up the whole time so we, uh, we've been pouring water in after every stage. We haven't had, uh, have, had the greatest run but that's motorsport and we got the end, luckily. Greg, you've been in this cave for long enough and won enough things but... It's pretty special when you can get something like a really key event like this under your belt. Another one? Yeah, well, it's another one. To me, it's most probably, uh, I think it's about the sixth one I've won. Yeah. Um, and I thoroughly enjoyed it. Pete did a magic job, absolutely fantastic. When I asked him to go and pedal hard, he went and pedal hard. Yeah. Told him to back off, took a bit, <laughs> but he back off. So, yeah, no, it, it, it was good management because yeah. that's what it was. But the problems that we had the other day, the management between the two of us to try and keep the car going and using our heads, no, and it's uh, it all came out the way it should have. People underestimate how hard it is to win from the front when you've got a lead like that and, and managing yeah. issues, don't they? Oh, yes, it is. Uh, it's totally, I mean, it's just unbelievable. And now people have come up to me and said, how do you do it from there and what you're doing? I said, well, it's just a matter of old, old fox, done it before, yeah. been there. Seems to be with this fella, mate. Yeah. This guy's on. It's, it's like we did this <laughs> two, time, two yeah. years ago. It was exactly the same. Yeah. It was something different. It was a clutch. And, talk, so. and talking about that, I mean, three wins now for you. This has been running 11 years. Only four winners of the modern group. Yeah. We're talking Duncan and Richards and yeah. Stevie Jones. It's a pretty big thing, isn't it? Oh, it is, mate, yeah. But I think we've, we've been lucky along the way as well to sort of notch up three wins. But, you know, yeah, to have, you know, Stevie's been awesome in this event. You know, Jim's just an icon of Australian motorsport and all around the world. And, you know, Ross is the same with rally. So, you know, yeah, to be up there with those guys is just awesome. Yeah, yeah. really good. You say lucky, you create your own luck. Well done to you both again, champions this year. Well Thanks, done. Guys, cheers. Thanks very much. <laughs> There we go, the champagne is flying after another amazing event. Fabulous weather, fabulous conditions for all of our teams. Congratulations. Just finishing this event is a major achievement in itself. I don't know how we can top it for next year, but they tell me we're going to. Cannot wait for the 2016 quit Targa West.